welcome, welcome to Fisher Price. Um, we have basically reimagined the learning aisle this year uh, with a brand new breakthrough line called Think and Play. And it allows uh, little learners to be big thinkers uh, through active and fun play because we know that's how preschoolers learn the best. Now our hero item coming out of this line is the Coda Pillar. And he's coming straight off of his debut at CES where he made quite a splash. Our Coda Pillar is not, an, not just an adorable character that comes to life with light sounds and actions, but he actually helps little learners be big thinkers by enhancing their problem solving and critical thinking skills. Yes, he's very excited right now to get going. So let me show you what he's all about. Now, Coda Pillar comes with eight individual segments that you see right here, as well as a motorized head. And in the earliest stage of learning, a child basically explores and sort of discovers possibilities of putting these different segments together to create what we call a code or a sequence to take him on his journey. Now I'll show you, I'm sorry to reach over here, I'll show you with this one what each one of these segments looks like. They each come apart like so, pop apart really easily, and each one of these segments represents a motion or a reaction. It's pretty self-explanatory, but like the straight arrow would make the coda pillar go straight. Uh, an arrow that bends to the left might take them to the left. One that bends to the right might take them right. And there's even a music segment. We also have expansion packs that have so much more and he can take up to about 15 segments at a time to program. But we start simply and I'll show you with our two fellows behind us how we play. All right, let's get some fancy dynamic lights going here. Power my friends up. Great. Now, we know they're reading the code when their lights start to activate and they start to make those silly sounds. And once they've done that, they are on their way, on their journey that we have put together, indicated by the various segments. So you can also see what part of the code they're reading because it flashes. As he's going left, the left arrow flashes. As he's going right, the right arrow flashes. And in production, their eyes will actually do the same thing and they will match the color of the segment that they are on. I'll give him a, like, a little explosion of light here. All right, good job, fellows. You did it. Yay! Now, as the child gets a little more advanced and more sophisticated with their coding, they can challenge themselves with these two target discs. We have a starting line and a finish line. And what you would do is you would try to take your little coda pillar apart and put him in such a pattern where he might start here but end there. And that takes some problem solving. So if you don't get it right the first time, that's okay. Take it back to point A and you start all over again. Children are also gonna come up with their own obstacles like pillows and chairs that they can work around. And they can even create maps that they draw and they can have the coda pillar try to follow. And if that wasn't fun enough, our Coda Pillar is going to have a companion app that's available that will add more fun games, more learning content, and it certainly brings the Coda Pillar together uh, in a whole new light with new animation. But the fun here is really the problem solving, the critical thinking, and the fact that it is fun, hands-on learning. And that is our Coda Pillar from the new Think and Learn line from Fisher Price.